Hello, welcome to Jen's Unique Nibbles and more. Today, it's a little shopping haul from Five Below. Ah, the light's really bad. Oh well. So, I went to Five Below the other day. I literally went for one thing. I went to get my daughter. Uh, she asked for a multi-stick by Wet n Wild. They have a silver color. That was the only one sold out. I guess everybody has good taste. So anyway, you can't go to Five Below and walk out of there empty-handed. It's like, probably not humanly possible. So I only bought a few things, but considering I went in for one thing and I got four different things. <laughs> so one of them is this beautiful herbal remedy handbook. Um, I work in a health food store environment. I've always had an interest in this sort of thing. And uh, they actually took away our program. So it's a little harder to help customers because they don't want us diagnosing and prescribing. So I get it, but it was a great tool that we used to have for personal information as well. And um, this is beautiful though, look at this. I wonder if I can flip through a book backwards. I don't know if I can. I mean, it's backwards because I have a hand. They just have really nice pictures in here. I'm randomly flipping through. It's a really, really, really beautiful book. Very educational. Lots of good information. I did a little, I won't say fact checking, but I checked on some of the ones that I knew, some of the herbs that I knew, and saw information that I, you know, agreed with, <laughs> that went along with what I knew. Um, it's just a super gorgeous book, and I wanted it. It's for me. I'm not going to use it at work. I'm sure I would get in trouble for that. But, oops, being such a big book. Look at that. It's supposed to be $19. I got it for five bucks. Sweet. I dropped my bag. All right, what else did I get? I got a little sanitizing ultraviolet wand type thing. Uh, it is battery operated. Yep, battery operated, lightweight and portable. And you know the pandemic? It's just feeling like it's never going to end, and I would have bought something like this a year ago, but they were really hard to find at that time, so I have one now. Um, just, there's, there's just times when that's going to be handy when you don't have a sanitizing wipe or something, and uh, just every once in a while you, you want to go over your keys and stuff, even if it's just like once a week. You just got to take care of things. Okay, I also got a pumice sponge. Um, I've actually I've never seen these for sale. I had one that was a gift. Uh, I think they bought theirs for me at Ulta Beauty Supply, and um, it's it's wearing out. I've had it for a long time, so these are cool. I mean, it looks like a weird sponge, feels like a magic eraser. It's like pumice, but not as volcano rock. It's much softer than that. You can use it wet or dry, and uh, it really helps the calluses on the feet. So anyway, you hardly ever see them. This was not $5. How much was that one? Hang on, drops my receipt. That was, that was $2.25. And then I bought, um, what is going wrong here? Oh, yeah, so we're, that was three out of the four, wasn't it? The last thing I bought was a pretty little concealer brush. Um, this was, this was, a dollar. A dollar for that is by Wet n Wild. And um, it's getting pretty bad. I'm feeling really old lately. So anyway, I thought maybe I could try to work a little magic with this thing. But I'm not really a makeup y person, so we'll see how it goes. Um, but anyway, so that was all for this particular trip. But pretty humorous since I really went for one thing and didn't manage to get that. So anyway, click that subscribe button if you want to see some of these snacks and other things that we buy. I've got some product reviews. Y'all have a great day. Bye-bye.